got a Caravelle upright freezer with a failed condenser fan motor. Um, uh, I couldn't get the guard off and then we look in here and there's some rivets. I just talked to a friend of mine who does a lot of these things and uh, you have to drill the rivets out to get the fan shroud off. So we took the bolts out from here and hopefully we can slide this forward enough to get a drill in there. Lucky I've got these uh, stubby drill bits to try out. I think we'll just about get in there. Um, it's going to be tight. That's got it. So that should be free. We've done the other one with that one, but I could, it's, it wouldn't fit in there this side. No, that pipe was in the way. And that motor was actually loose. Okay, the hub had actually broke, seized up. The, the, the hub actually uh, broken from the original say five watt five watt if you don't if you haven't got a label you just match the stack height how wide that part is no it's ever the same it's better it's the same near enough the same wattage Okay, we've given them a clean. We've got some cloths in there. So I'm going to give it a blast out with a jet washer. Put one underneath. See how we get on. It's cleaned up nice. Don't use too much water. It most we go in there on the tails. She sees right now. Right, you want to compare the stack height with your two new mode, with your old and new. And then the other thing is how fast far the shaft sticks out. That one's a bit longer. What you should try and do is get from a mounting bolt, and then you can see how the difference is to that one. So it's about four or five mil deeper. And that, that'll move the blade nearer the condenser. Uh, so sometimes you have to put another nut on there just to space that back a bit. Right, I've cut the mounting feet off here and these had some little buttresses in I've cut them out for the grinder because it wouldn't it wouldn't sit in the guard. Um, you can cut the guard out if you want but I decided to do the motor. This is like a universal one you can mount it on the studs feet top and bottom and then it's got three bolts holes front and back all different types of mountains, whereas it, these are just designed, designed to be on the guard, so they don't actually drill any of these holes out. Right, we put the little blanking, we come with these little plastic blanking plugs, you can put them in and keep the dust out. And they come with a set of nuts and bolts and things. A spare uh, um, hub. Ok, 
Okay, got the blade on there. self tappers in where those rivets were. Just got a zap off of that. Must be um, power installed in the capacitor. So let's see if we can get it for this leading. It's 150 volts, I think, when I first put it on there. 190. Something to be careful of. Not in. So we have to get that push back in. It's a bit there as well. Thought we'd have a look at the chest freezer while we were waiting for that to come down. Well, that's not too bad. It's got one of them copper. Coil condensers, so just give it a brush and give the grills a bit of a brush. <laughs> 